My name is Dr. Nora Chamberlain and I'm a mathematical modeler. What is mathematical modeling? Mathematical modeling is when you look into reality, to convert that reality into mathematics, find a solution, then apply that solution into the real world. I said, what does that got to do with an energy company? I said, because Every time you lose a, competitor, lose a customer to, com to a competitor, you actually know what price they're actually giving to you, your customer. And every time you win uh, 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 a customer from your competitor, you learn something about the price range of your competitor. And then actually, by building a simulation model with this range of prices, you can actually see what strategy they actually are doing. An example of mathematical modelling was dates back into 1796. There was a mathematician, a French mathematician called Laplace. He looked up at the sky and says, out there, in space, there exists a body that not even light can escape. The scientists and the mathematicians at the time didn't agree and thinking, you must be crazy. But what Laplace actually discovered was a black hole. And this was over 100 years before Einstein's theory of relativity. Can you imagine a French mathematician discovered this without the aid of computers, x-rays or satellites? So can you imagine what a mathematician can do using mathematical modelling on things that he can see now on Earth? Now, why did I get out into the industry? Well, this is me way, 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 way back, you know, and this is me when, um, when I was actually doing my mathematics degree. And third year of my mathematics degree is actually to work on an RF phase, and I have to do some a mathematical modeling for the RAF. And this is actually my first time I've actually been a mathematical modeler. And my personal interpretation of a mathematical modeler is somebody that looks into reality, then translates it into mathematics, come up with a solution, and then apply it into the real world. And so I had the experience of being a real life RAF pilot, and thought, yes, I'm a bit, yes, I can be an RAF pilot. So henceforth, my first mathematical model which simulation I wrote had nothing to do with aircrafts, assault or fighter planes, it was actually to do with kitchens. As for me, I used to work on an RAF base to work out when a kitchen should be refurbished. You're thinking, surely I should be working on aircraft. But to find out when the optimum time to refurbish a kitchen was very sophisticated mathematically. Another job that I worked is when I went over to the Netherlands working on a computer virus to make a Formula One car go faster. Again, this is another example of mathematical modelling in action.